Yeah, so far so good. I mean, they came in in great shape and uh, the first couple weeks have, have gone well, so I'm excited to kind of see where these guys are at and, and what they can do. Uh, this first one is the Aki Twilight. What is that race course like and uh, what are you hoping to get out of the first meet? Uh, it's a great meet. It's a great atmosphere. Uh, they got the music going, uh, people just lining the, um, the course the entire time. It's a bunch of loops, so um, there's always somebody there cheering. Um, it's flat as flat can be, so it's it's usually fast and uh, running a nice kind of fun uh, course is lined by glow sticks, so the kids uh, get pretty pretty amped up for that. Losing Amanda and uh, a couple of our other uh, of the top seven, but we still have four of those seven that were at the meet last year are returning. Having McKenna back and you know experiencing the national track meet and or national cross country meet, and she wants to get back. Um, but just her leadership and um, with the younger kids and uh, helping motivate them and encourage them um, to help get us back to the national meet again. Um, I think just connecting with my team. We have a lot of young people on our team this year um, that haven't experienced a lot of what college has to offer. So I'm excited to kind of hand over the reins and give them the experience that I had when I was younger and hopefully more. So. Yeah, we've gotten really close over the years and just kind of done stuff outside of um, practice and just like team bonding and just kind of laughing together on the bus and not taking life so seriously too, so. Yeah, they're coming along. Um, uh, Madison Matzchek and Alexi McDonald are sophomores this year um, and I've seen a huge improvement from them from last year just to, to the start of this fall. Um, we have Maria Seltig coming in as a freshman. Um, I think we'll, we'll crack our top seven right away. Um, but yeah, no, I'm, I'm excited. Uh, you know, some of the freshmen, it's nerves and kind of working through those a little bit. Um, but I, I, think, uh, I think they're all gonna be contributors on the team. I love the 5K. The 5K is a good distance to start out with. And it's in the dark, so it's kind of like all expectations out the window and just kind of go out there and grind, honestly. You're just kind of running for for fun and for time and it's so fun afterwards everybody's just excited and pumped for the season so. So we've had a couple of really good workouts um, uh, this past week and uh, a couple of the week before um, but uh, there it's we don't want to peak yet um, so kind of training through these first couple of meets but from what I've seen right now in these last two weeks you know I think uh, big things are going to happen if we take care of little things big things will, will take care of themselves. To be top three at regionals is the top three goal. Top three go to nationals, so that's kind of the big goal of the season. But I think just um, having our top seven be pretty close. Um, we have a good four through seven this year. Two freshmen and a lot of like people coming up, and everybody's really competitive and really close and works really well in workouts, so I'm excited to see where it goes. I do think we have a chance. I mean, it's a very tough conference. It's one of the toughest uh, conferences on the women's side in, in Division II, um, and our, our region as well. Is, uh, seeing that we've got, uh, we had, what, six teams from our region at the national meet last year. So, um, But I think anything's possible. I know that's our, our goal, to, to win it. Um, definitely be top three, but uh, ultimate goal is to win.